What's up you guys, hope you're doing well. My name is Rob Allen, I'm a direct response copywriter who's generated over $100 million in sales. And in this video today, I wanna show you guys a weird Shopify glitch that increases conversions by up to 200%. That's so easy to execute, so fast to actually test out that you're gonna be like, why aren't more people doing this? Cause it almost works too well. But before we get into that, I just wanna tell you guys a quick story of how I actually discovered this because a while back I was working with a client who had a bunch of aggressive goals for their store. They wanted to increase the average order value. They wanted a ton of upsells. They wanted more customers buying things and bundles together. And normally the way you approach this is you go out and you get some Shopify apps that actually help you as a marketer actually do these things, but the client told us, we do not want any more apps in our store. I don't wanna pay for them. I don't want them integrating. I think they're a pain in the butt and I do not wanna deal with it. And I was like, um, okay, well that makes it way harder, but I guess we're just gonna figure this out ourselves. So I ended up going down a deep Shopify rabbit hole that not only allowed me to discover a way to actually do all these things and more, but it actually worked even better than any tools I've ever tried. First thing that happened was that it actually tripled conversion rates because of the way that it's set up and the way that it works, it allows for actual Actually, truly one click checkout. A customer can be in an email, click one single button and already be in checkout in just one tap and they are ready to check out. And not just that, it also doubled the average order value because this weird technique actually allows you to bundle lots of products together without any clicking on the site, just one click checkout. And it scaled infinitely without any extra Shopify apps or software. If you had an idea for any combinations of products to go together, you could set it up using this weird technique that I'm gonna show you guys and it works like crazy. It works like crazy every time you test it out. So please do this and show you how this works. I'm going to hop on over to my computer and actually build out one of these one-click checkout bundles in real time so that you can see the full process in action. So I hopped on over to my computer to actually show you how this works. And I pulled up this brand called Disco that I've seen blowing up in the DTC space right now. They are a men's skincare company and they do some really cool stuff. But we're not here to talk about their products. We're here to show you how to increase the conversion rate of any product that you're selling using this weird Shopify glitch. So the first thing you're going to need to do is just go over to the product page for any product that you sell built on a Shopify store. And you're gonna go up to the URL at the top and you're gonna type at the end dot XML. And what that's gonna spit back to you is a page that looks like this, which looks like you have hacked some mainframe and you are in the matrix. But trust me, it's not that confusing. It's actually very clear what to do. The only thing we need to do is actually go over here into the code of the page and grab this ID type integer, this number here. And what this number is, is basically a unique code that tells Shopify, hey, this is the product that we wanna grab and we're gonna actually be able to use this information to throw this product into the cart. So basically we're gonna use that code. We're going to add a colon and we're going to choose the amount of that product that we want to actually add. So for example, if we wanted to add three of these to the cart, we would basically just type in that URL, add backslash cart plus that product plus the quantity of three. And then this should actually send us to a cart that has all of that information preloaded into it, where notice now we have three repairing eye sticks preloaded into our cart and it's instant checkout. Imagine using that link, going out of an email and you're already into a preloaded shop pay. It's one click and you can pay now. You don't have to add anything. You don't have to think about it at all. And so we're right in the cart with the exact quantity of items preloaded. The customer doesn't have to think about anything. All they have to click is that one single button that says pay now and they're done checking out just like that. And with shop pay on, it makes it so easy, so fast, so seamless. And a lot of customers have this turned on. So that's one of the reasons why it increases conversion rates so much because all of it is in the cart just like that. But as we talked about before, we don't just want to actually add the one product, we want to add multiple of them. And what we wanna do is go to a second product in the store, and this one is a face cleanser stick. And we're gonna do the same thing here, .xml into the end of the URL there. And we're gonna get back this page that looks like we've entered the matrix, but we're gonna only grab this ID type, this integer number here. So I'm gonna throw this one into a notepad as well. And let's go grab one more product here. So we're on this new URL here for the product page. I'm gonna type .xml to the end of the URL again, grab that code. So now that we've got all three products, what we need to do is choose a combination of them that we want to do by actually editing this top URL here where all of them are going to go into a preloaded cart. So what we need to do is go back to the URL combination that we have. And instead of actually doing three, and stopping there, we're gonna add a comma to the end of the URL. And what that comma is gonna tell it is, hey, don't just stop at that product, go get a few more as well. So let's imagine we wanna add three of that additional product that we had chosen, and let's go grab that last one there and get three more of it as well. What that is gonna do is grab three of each of those individual products and load them into a preloaded cart that the customer doesn't have to think about at all. Notice that it's got all of the items that we had talked about already preloaded. 
all the customer has to do is hit that pay now button. No Shopify apps, no bundling tools, just one click right into the checkout page. It's a preloaded cart and it's so seamless and so smooth and so fast. And even that is still level one of the optimization. So say you wanted to create a unique combination of these items bundled up together and you wanted to provide a unique discount at the end, basically just at the end of the URL, you're gonna add a question mark, discount equals and whatever that unique discount code that you wanted to actually create for this unique bundle of products. And you hit enter there and look at that. It's preloaded into the cart. All of that savings is loaded up and the customer doesn't have to think about it for one second. And that's how you triple conversion rates. That's how you double the average order value. And that's how you do it all without having to have any Shopify apps actually plugged into your store. This also allows you to move very fast because if you create a new product and you wanna try testing out unique combinations of them together, this is how you do it, right in the URL itself, right to the checkout page right there, and your customers will thank you for making it so easy on them, and you will be happy because your bottom line will be thanking you as well. So hopefully you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to actually like it and subscribe to the channel. I love creating little Shopify tips like this and tons of email marketing content, and I can't imagine being a copywriter not subscribed to this channel because it's the best one. Let's be.